If you are an adult with a mild to moderate hearing loss and you want access to a direct to consumer pair of hearing aids that is top tier, top of the line, but a fraction of the cost of traditional hearing aids, in addition to having access to a remote audiologist almost anytime and anywhere, the Orca 2 may be a good fit for you. The Orca company was founded by Ben Sun. He's a co-founder and CEO. He was visiting his grandmother and noticed that she was having a difficult time with her hearing devices. Now, at this time, Mr. Sun worked at Apple. While fiddling with his grandma's hearing devices, he noticed that they didn't have any noise reduction capabilities. And he thought, wow, this seems like a big miss on the hearing aid design. And so he decided to mesh his knowledge with the need for good hearing devices and create the company Orca. Mr. Sun and the team at Orca want to create top of the line noise reduction hearing devices that are available direct to consumer to cut out costs and offer amazing technology for those who are hard of hearing that need and want it. Not only does the company employ Mr. Sun as the CEO, but it also employs many other high tech individuals, meaning that these individuals have experience with major technology companies. This means that these devices are created and designed by those who know technology best and how to use it and how to apply it. And after trying the devices myself, I can tell you that these are pretty high tech direct to consumer hearing aids. Let's just start off by my experience with these hearing aids. Typically in these reviews, I wait till the end to share my experience after sharing the features, but we're just gonna dive right in. From the time that I collaborated with Orca on this, they sent me a new pair and I received several emails to let me know that my order had been filed, received, shipped, and after I did receive it, I still received a follow-up email to say, how are your devices performing? I also received consistent outreach and encouragement to meet with their remote audiologist, Dr. Salenci. I was really impressed by the prompt and consistent customer service that Orca offers. And I will say this A plus customer experience just continues with their unboxing experience. From the moment I received the package and opened it, I had these devices up and running in almost no time. Regardless of whether you're tech savvy or prefer paper, Orca offers both of the options when you open the package. So you do need a smartphone to use the app and to really unleash the power of these devices. You do need to be a little tech savvy, but I was really impressed with the fact that I had access to a paper user's manual. And the unboxing experience walks you through step-by-step -step of how to start using these direct to consumer hearing aids. Honestly, there's so much I could talk about here. There's a little paper, you download the app. When I go into the app, there are two programs normal and in noise. They were so simple, it was intuitive. And that is shockingly difficult for a lot of DTC and OTC hearing aid brands to execute well on. Orca nailed it. After wearing these hearing aids, I subsequently met with Orca's remote audiologist. She was wonderful. She asked me how I was doing, how sound is for me, what sounds I like, what sounds I dislike and how my experience with the Orca 2 was going for me. She noticed that I had uploaded an audiogram. This is a cool app feature and the hearing aids can be tuned to your audiogram. So rather than just like volume up, volume down, which it definitely has on the case in the app, those features are there, but it has the fine tuning. And when the remote audiologist implemented the responses from my audiogram, I noticed a difference. 
I noticed the clarity and my ability to hear and understand definitely improved. It was good with the devices as is, but to be able to upload an audiogram and talk with a remote audiologist, I feel like my experience was just elevated even more with the Orca 2 devices. One thing that was really, I guess, substantial for me was I was having difficulty understanding my son. Um, he is two years old. He's learning to speak, so he's already hard to understand. But when I talked with the remote audiologist and expressed my concerns, she was able to make a high frequency setting adjustment. Now, looking at my audiogram, she could tell that I definitely struggle to hear and understand high frequencies, but she was able to make adjustments that made it even easier for me to understand those high frequencies, particularly manifest in my son's voice. A lot of people take hearing for granted because they forget that it implies understanding. And so to be able to go to the pet store and have my son look at the fish and talk and exclaim and realize that I could hear him without having to see or read his lips is huge for me. Like, it was really crazy to think that I could have been missing out on his cute exclamations, but really I was a part of it. And I wouldn't have known, I wouldn't have heard his, his little comments and cute little high-pitched comments about the fishies. But because I had good hearing devices, I was able to enjoy that experience. And I found a lot of joy in it. In addition to excellent customer experience, having access to a remote audiologist almost anytime and anywhere with the Orca 2, the devices are known and made for their AI noise reduction. And let me tell you, it's insane. It works so well, I had to learn to just trust it. I think that was the biggest adjustment for me is I felt like things were quiet. I didn't feel like I was in a fishbowl like I usually do when I change hearing aids. I felt like things were just calm, peaceful. And for a while, it took me about a day to get used to, but for a little bit, I had FOMO. I had the fear of missing out because I couldn't hear my fridge, my dishwasher, the furnace. But then I realized I don't need to hear those things. With the Orca 2, I could still hear my husband talking, my son talking, the things that were really important. And so it was nice to just like relax. I don't need to hear everything. And I would definitely say that I think some of my hearing fatigue was reduced because I wasn't constantly taking in sounds that I didn't need. So that was interesting and very eye-opening. And the noise reduction is wildly good. So I've talked about a lot, but let's talk about some of the obvious things that a lot of direct-to-consumer or over-the-counter hearing aids have, and that is Bluetooth connectivity. Now, Orca 2 steps it up. You can connect to up to eight devices. I was connected to four at a time. My phone, my computer, my iPad, and the TV. I would say that I use those devices consistently, persistently, and it was amazing to switch between all of them. Because of the way that this Bluetooth connectivity is set up, I simply just had to turn on my device, make sure that it was sending the sound to the respective Orca 2 Bluetooth device, and I could hear. I currently wear ReSound 1 behind the ear hearing aids. Keep in mind they're an older model, but I have to connect those and disconnect them. They cannot connect to my TV and I do not have them connected to my computer. They can't because um, something with the Bluetooth capabilities doesn't work. And then with my iPad and my phone, I have to disconnect it to my phone, take it off completely, forget this device, and then reconnect it on my iPad. It's such a hassle, I've only done it once. But with the Orca 2, the Bluetooth connectivity, I had them all connected within that day. Okay, it took me a little longer to get the TV on board, but like, it was amazing. So I highly recommend the Orca 2 for anyone who is creatively minded, uses a lot of technology, watches TV, if you use your iPad, your phone, if you're on different devices, you need a device that can connect to all of those. You can throw your earbuds away, you can throw your over the ear headphones away, and you get great sound quality, not just in your environment with the Orca 2, but from your devices because of the excellent Bluetooth technology and connectivity options.
So overall, if you can't already tell, I'm a huge fan of the Orca 2 hearing aid devices. I kind of do want to review just a little bit. They are a receiver in the canal model. They have some really cool features. One that I love is you can double tap to pick up the phone. With my ReSound ones, I have to pick up the phone from my phone, speak through my phone, all of that. These are amazing. You can pick up a call through the Orca 2, talk through the Orca 2, and hang up with the Orca 2. It's just brilliant in this tiny little thing, okay? Look at that. Now, I will say I wear my ReSound ones because I have a moderate to severe loft. I do benefit from a little bit more power in my right ear, but this thing packs a punch. I'm pretty impressed. Let's talk about battery power. So these are rechargeable. They come with this amazingly sleek little case. I think the case is designed so well. It doesn't have sharp edges. It's an easy object to find in my bag because I would take the case with me kind of wherever I went. The rechargeable battery lasts about nine to 12 hours, depending on how much you stream which honestly is a little short sometimes in the day, especially for me. I like to have my hearing aids last about 16 to 20 hours. But that said, uh, because the case is so easy to carry, I found that I could just take my hearing aids out in the car, pop them in, or if I just didn't really need them, just pop them in. And it was amazing. One thing I love about the case is there's program here. So you can switch from the normal to in noise setting or there's volume adjustments right here. Also features a removable charging cord, which it comes with, and a charging block. Not all direct to consumer hearing aids come with the charging block and the cord. It's nice that this one's removable because then you can really carry around the case without having to like wrap a cord. So from multiple angles, the customer experience, the case, and the devices themselves, I just feel like the Orca 2 is really well designed. And yes, these are FDA approved. So if you are an adult with mild to moderate hearing loss, these may be a good fit for you, especially if you want a self-fit, low cost, but incredibly high quality option, these could be for you. So let's talk about the last thing. How much do these incredible devices cost? Well, they are currently and regularly listed on the site as a cost of $1,899 for the pair. Keep in mind you're getting two. Keep in mind that these are very smart AI noise reduction hearing devices. These are direct to consumer devices, which means that they are self-fit, but with the customer experience and audiologist support that is provided, whatever typical barriers there are, if those kept me from getting hearing devices, I, I straight up told my husband I would buy these because they are, <laughs> let's just say like they're amazing and I'm very impressed. They have a 45 day trial. So if you're interested in these, invest in yourself, go check them out, try the 45 day trial. And I'm just going to say, I hope that you are as impressed as I have been. Try all the features have people call you, call them back, try everything out and see if they're a good fit for you. But I just have to say, the Orca 2 is here for you. Do you have any questions for me about the Orca 2 or my experience wearing it? If so, please let me know in the comments below. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you stay strong, stay amazing, and have a great day. Bye.